Hello, in this video we we'll talk about the long-term solution to the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. I think that the long-term solution to the Israeli-Palestinian conflict is a two-state solution. And uh, when I think about the solution to the conflict, I only talk about the solution that is the best from the point of view of the Israelis and without looking at all at the well-being of the Palestinians or what they demand. As far as Israel is concerned, the Israelis want to live in peace and tranquility without fear of attacks and terrorism and that there will be more budgets for health, education and that there will be less need to invest in uh, security. Okay, or to invest less in the defense budget. And the only way to achieve this goals is to lower the motivation of the Palestinians to arm Israel. As soon as millions of Palestinians are motivated to arm Israel, it will not be possible to prevent it in any way. Therefore, in my opinion, the October 7th massacre it is a failure of the it is a failure at the strategic level of Israel and not an intelligence failure. After the Israeli-Palestinian conflict is resolved, it will uh, be possible to make peace with the other Arab countries and it will be possible to invest less in uh, defense, less in security. Israel, uh, Israel's economic situation will be much better because in, this, uh, in a state of peace in the Middle East no country will boycott Israel and much more investments will flow into Israel and many large companies we also want to invest in Israel and establish branches in Israel. And in the context of the threat of Israel's destruction, our enemies will not be able to do this because of the nuclear weapon that Israel has. It is clear that dealing with terrorism will not solve the root of the problem and the causes of the terrorism must be dealt with. The, uh, the other side will not agree to accept and, uh, and accommodate the existing reality. If Israel doesn't uh, agree to make them citizens, then the only solution is to give them their own state. And I don't care at all about the fate of the Palestinians, only the problem is that without changing reality, we Israelis will continue to suffer, so the two-state solution will end the tremendous suffering of the Israelis and this is uh, what needs to be done for the benefit of the citizens of Israel. Okay, thank you very much.